just a quick tutorial here on how to edit your contact form. So you will want to go to Forms, Contact Us form, and you'll see name, email address, reason why you're reaching out today. If you want to change what this says, just click on it and it opens settings and you can change that field label of what you're asking for the text area. Um, right now we have name, email, and the reason all required. You'll see the required button. Um, if you want to add fields, you have options over here. Um, I do suggest that you keep the form short and sweet, uh, whatever it takes to get people to contact you. If it gets too lengthy, then um, sometimes people will just say, never mind. <laughs> um, so you can add any fields that are offered here. So let's say you want to add somebody's address. You can put that there. In order to make that required, you have to say required. You can remove country as a requirement too. Um, you know, you could remove any of these things. You could just leave zip and remove state, whatever you want to do, just click it off and on. Uh, you can drag and drop to rearrange things, anything you want to do. Uh, but the key most important thing here is go to settings and notifications. I'm not going to keep those changes. Okay. The admin notification means your email address. So whatever email address you want the form to submit to, you would put it here. So info at submit.com, let's just say that's your email address. And then you'll want to put that same email address in the from email too. Um, the subject line, so when you receive the email, it could say new um, contact form from church website, whatever you want the subject line to say when you receive it, you'd put there. And then this all fields code just means it's going to give you all the information that was submitted. Um, and then you click update. So this is how you set where the form gets sent and back in the edit area is where you um, would add or edit any of the questions.